Multiple people injured in an overnight shooting. Good evening. I'm Cynthia Arsenault. And I'm Jillian Quarter. Lake Charles police say the shooting happened at a lounge in downtown Lake Charles. KPLC's Andrea Robinson is standing by live with details. Lake Charles police say at least eight victims were shot around 1.30 this morning at VVS1 Hookah Lounge on Broad Street. Three of them are listed in critical condition at last word. Police have one person in custody, but are still working to determine if there was more than one shooter involved. Police haven't released any more details. We did speak with Van Ned, the owner of the lounge. He says it all happened inside where everyone was having a great time until shots were fired. He says it sounded like fireworks erupting. Ned tells 7 News with eight security guards on staff, he believes weapons were brought in through the courtyard where a tent was set up. The tent is not typically there, so he thinks it may have obscured the view of the fence, allowing someone to sneak weapons in. He also tells us one of his security guards helped to do the shooter. Tonight, the owner says he takes security at the hookah lounge very seriously and apologizes to the victims and their families. In Lake Charles, Andrea Robinson, 7 News. Lake Charles Police Chief Sean Caldwell released a statement this afternoon that said in part, quote, responding to a shooting with one victim, much less eight, is something we as law enforcement hope to never have to do on shift. However, when violent acts of this nature do occur, our officers stand ready to respond immediately. I am proud of all the first responders who responded to this call, particularly our patrol officers who personally transported victims to the hospital, end quote. And Lake Charles Mayor Nick Hunter said in a statement, quote, this morning's shooting is saddening and disturbing. Acts of senseless violence in any community are always difficult to hear about. But when it happens in our city, it's a painful realization of the realities of the lack of value some place on human life. Solving issues with violence is never the answer, end quote. Stay with 7 News on the air for continuing coverage of the Hookah Lounge shooting. We'll also have updates online at kplctv.com and your 7 News mobile app.